what's going on guys welcome back to another video in today's video we're going to be building a modern courthouse in minecraft before i get into the video um i know i haven't uploaded in like almost a week and a half and that's because i was camping and then i just didn't really have time to make any other youtube videos um but now i have time to make a youtube video so let's get right into the video so what we're going to need for this build is gray concrete glass pane quartz stairs uh, quartz pillar, stone brick stairs, iron door, lectern, and oak stairs, uh, jungle planks, spruce stairs, oak planks, and oak slabs, and we actually need jungle stairs as well. Alright, so to start off, what we're going to do is we're going to take our gray concrete, I'm going to place one, two, three, four, five, we're going to go one, two, three, Four, then one, two, one, two, three, four. So it should be. So how it's gonna work is it's gonna be space here between the wall and the seats are gonna be. Then it's gonna be a row of three seats, then the um, hall, and then one, two, three, and then the space, and then the wall. So it should be a total of. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And I come out by three, four. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your gray concrete and one block in, you're gonna do this. And you're just gonna fill this in. You're also gonna need stone brick. Then you're gonna take your stone brick stairs, you're gonna go like this. And then you're gonna take them again and add another layer. Then take your stone brick and go one, two, like this. Then you're gonna take your gray concrete like this. Like that. And you're going to find the middle, so one, two, three, four, five. So on either side of that, it'll be like that. Then you're going to take your iron door and you're going to place it so it looks like that. So it's already open, so we don't have to uh, manually open it. It's just already open. Then we're going to go build up by two, and then these will be punched out to build windows, um, but that will come last. So now that we've done that, we're going to add up by three now, like this. This is as tall as this building will get. Then we need to go back, or yeah, this way by one, two. So this is going to be five rows of seats. So row, space, row, space. So you want to go 10 in total. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then it's going to be the um, judge's podium thing. So we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. And then for the wall, six. And we're going to go close it in. Not too far. And we're going to build up by one more layer around this. And then we will build the floor. And we will start putting things on the inside. So we actually have light instead of lighting it ourselves, which we will do after. So for the floor on the inside, we're going to use jungle planks. If you have world edit, I do recommend using it because it is a lot quicker. Um, for bedrock players, I do not know if there is world edit. And console players and mobile players, I know for sure there's no world edit. But for PC bedrock players, um, I actually don't know, so if you do play on Bedrock, can you tell me in the comment section below if there is a world edit for it? Because I am on Java Edition, which there is a world edit for, which I do not have using. I actually don't even know if I have it installed. I wish I did. So bring this all the way back. going to take um, your spruce stairs and you're gonna go one two one two three like 
that and leave a space one two three 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 and then you're gonna go another one two three one two three and then you're going to take um, oak uh, slabs and oak stairs I'm just gonna make like a little table up oh, sorry it's supposed to be right in front like a little table like this a little table thing where the your your the uh the, um whoever the person the lawyer and the I guess the um I don't even know what you call him the guy who's getting courted uh, so now we're going to take our jungle stairs again and then um one two like that one one two then our jungle planks like this and just fill it in one level like this then you're gonna go here and you're gonna go one two i'm oh, sorry one two three four then you're going to take your lectern and you're going to place it here and then you're going to take a bell this will be like the judge's hammer bell thing and you're going to place it there so court in session you got his lectern or whatever so now let's build up the walls so all the way to the top so that's i think five high pause the video and when I'm done with the walls I'll be back all right guys I now have the wall done and before I continue I do actually want to make one change that is optional um, I did forget that there is supposed to be a jury um, so if you do want a to actually have a jury here uh, you might want to uh, do this modification with me so what we're gonna do is we're gonna move this lectern and this bell and um, we're going to move everything one block over like this and then there's going to be a chair here for the jury just like that pretty much and just kind of move it one block over or you can just do um that so it's still somewhat set up oh, sorry not that so it's still somewhat centered and then there's also the option of just you know putting a lectern there like that like that i'm oh, sorry I keep doing that like that and that and then the jury is just still kind of there or you can do something like this uh really it's really up to you i'm probably going to leave it like if i did something i'm actually going to move the jury one over so if you did something like this i do think that looks pretty good myself maybe if you put a chair there as well and then the bell kind of like there. so this it could be your upgraded office which i actually do like much better um, so now we're going to go onto the roof. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our gray concrete and um, one, two, three, four, five, six, just kind of like this, a layer, and then basic roof standards. Oh, wait, there we go. Basic roof standards, just bring it in by one every time. And perfect. And then uh, you can do the same on the other side. to do is we are going to build some beams across to make it easier to put the roof in um, because as we all know as hard as building roofs are this will make it a hundred times simpler I can almost guarantee money back <laughs> money back guaranteed sorry guys if you can hear my intense keyboard clicking I uh, I've always tried to use noise suppression on OBS studios, which is what I use to record, and it absolutely sucks. All right, so I will um, pause the video once I show you guys uh, a little bit of how to do the roof. So we're gonna have it just uh, hanging down like this by one, which is kind of self-explanatory. Just do this all the way around, 
and then I will show you guys how to use these beams after. Let's kind of do this, all right? Normal roof stuff. And then when you get to these beams, all you have to do is just place on the bottom one like this. Nothing weird, sketchy, crouching like this type stuff. So you just place on the bottom of the beam. So much easier. So I will be back once I do the roof. All right, so we have um, done the roof now. So your roof should look something like this. And the only thing you might have had to actually use the weird crouch and stare thing that everyone uses is just for one of these roof rows, top rows on the roof. But that's okay. Uh, so now what you're going to do is you're going to take your quartz pillar and on this block right here, we're going to go up all the way till it lines up with that block. And same with this one right here, like that. Then you're just going to take your stairs and just out like that, all the way like this. It's very, very simple, just like that. And then all you have to do from there is um, quartz block. Again, forgot it. And guys, a lot of the times, if you are wondering why I don't always uh, plan things out before, it's because usually when I'm building uh, a Minecraft build, I usually am planning it as I go because um, it's easier that way and it makes me help be able to see it more. Um, so yeah, so now what you guys are going to do is you're going to take your quartz stairs, one, two, three, kind of like on either side of the door like this, two, three, and then you're going to just fill it in and you're going to go fill it in again. Now this is going to be where you'd have a clock usually, um, but it's Minecraft, so I don't know if you really could, or if you put some maps or like some item frames there and then went and built a giant clock and or each quarter of a clock or something and put it there then that would look really really cool or if you made a banner or something but i am not that good at that kind of stuff so now it's time for our uh, windows so what we're going to do is from the door leave a space of one and we're just going to one two three one two three one two three one two three, one, two, three. and same on the other side one two three one two three and if you really want above the door like that. So that's what the front should look like now. Then uh, we're going to go on the outside and uh, one, two, three, like this. Make space, one, two, three, like this. One, two, three. Then leave a space like this. Leave space, one, two, three, like this. Then you're going to leave a double space like this and like this like that. So we're going to come to the other side right here. One, two, three. Oh, too low. Silly me. One, two, three. Leave space. One, two, three. Leave space of two. One, two, three. Wow, I really miss. Ah, I hate glass panes so much. Why do I use them? Why do they have to look so good? One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Now it comes to the optional part of the build. Um, you may or may not want to add your own natural or um, unnatural lighting in, as in lanterns, torches, or any other uh, light object. Um, or you can continue to just use the natural light, which I do very much like. But, um, one second. Don't give me those black lines. I hate them. Oh well. Um, but um, I am going to add some other kinds of lights. I probably will use sea lanterns because they look probably the best in my opinion. And um, they offer a good amount of light. And they don't look bad. And if you didn't know, they have movement. Which is really cool. And just make it identical so it doesn't look weird. So just two like that. And you just look down and there. That is actually perfect lighting, and if you very if you want to, you can actually destroy these pillars. These are just temporary building pillars, or you can leave them, or do the whole thing like that if you don't want people to see in the roof. That is 100% up to you. And if you even wanted to make this look even cleaner, you could destroy all this and put this there, which is actually I'm what I'm going to do because it's bothering me so much. So if you just want to destroy this gray line, and just put them there because that actually bothered me so much. I don't know why, but it did. A 
lot. It's probably bothered a lot of you guys too. And I'm sorry. I do 100% apologize and take full credit for this um, catastrophe. Like that. There you go. So you got a courthouse. So guy comes in, sits down. His lawyer's here. The judge is screaming, court order, court, kind of thing, you know. And then there's just people sitting here like. Mommy, I'm bored. That kind of thing. But yeah, anyways, guys, that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, uh -oh. I hope you guys enjoyed. I, for some reason, my Minecraft just did something weird. Hope you guys enjoyed, and see you in the next one. Bye-bye.